Okay, Cal News meteorologist Paul Deano is back with your next weather forecast. And Paul, we just got to get through the week. That's to it. Make it to the weekend. Uh, and for, um, for more than one reason, <laughs> yes. The, the work part of it, but also the weather part of it. Mother Nature has been saving some of the nicest weather. It's been a rough stretch weather the past couple months relative to what's normal to us. Weekends have not been that bad. Weekend we just had. Pretty good. Next weekend, really good to get outside. 57 degrees, a few slivers of sunshine in Ontario. This is a wind advisory for our inland deserts, including the Antelope Valley and also the San Bernardinos, the mountains themselves. We could see some wind gusts of 40 to 50 miles per hour today, tonight, and tomorrow. It'll just be breezy elsewhere, but no wind advisories in and around Los Angeles. The wind is thrown around the pollen. Tree pollen has been high for the past two weeks. It may enter the very high or extreme category by the end of this week because there are no weather systems coming to bring us widespread rainfall. That's a good thing. We don't need any more rain, but it does help out with the pollen. Inland Empire, I think by 2 o'clock you'll begin to see some sunshine. It likely will be a sunny afternoon. Not a warm one. If we're going to hit 70 degrees, it's going to be for like 5 or 10 minutes. That's it. The average first 85 degree day is more than a month ago. Two years ago we did it in mid-January. Last year we did it in mid-February. We haven't been above 80 yet this year. I'm showing you that graphic for a reason because this is next weekend. 87 degrees in Los Angeles and 82 coming up on Sunday. Big pattern change coming. So where are we right now? We still have a dip in the jet stream over Northern California and the Pacific Northwest. No rain for us, but we are feeding in the stronger onshore flow. So even when a storm misses, it still kind of hits. It still impacts our weather. So we have the clouds. We will for the next hour or two. We still keep the onshore flow even without the cloud cover, so we're cooler today, and the clouds will likely return tomorrow. The pattern begins to change on Wednesday as the onshore flow is lighter, so we get sunshine earlier. Then by Thursday, the winds literally change direction. We get a offshore wind, which will warm us up into a territory we have not seen since last Thanksgiving. Temperatures will make it into the mid to upper 80s on Friday and Saturday. Today and tomorrow, chilly. Wednesday, sunnier. Thursday, we're warmer, and Friday is the day where we finally get into the 80s for the first time this calendar year. The rest of our extended forecast coming up next half hour. KCAL 9 is now KCAL News. CBS News Los Angeles, your local news, streaming wherever, whenever.